Welcome back, Ink Chasers, to another TTM Mel Day video. Um, this video is pretty much the last couple weeks. I know I've been super busy, so I haven't been able to get a lot of videos out. Um, hoping for that to change. Um, but before all I get to all that, I just wanted to mention um, a couple videos ago I showed off my um, Frank Lucchese autographs that I got in TTM and mentioned that he was getting in pretty bad health. Um, this past Sunday, he did pass away. So, uh, my condolences to his family. And um, thank you for all the great autographs you've sent throughout the mail to everyone in these past uh, past years. And if anybody um, has anything out, I'm not sure if it's going to be back. <laughs> Alright, um, and then before I get to the TTMs, I did want to show you, uh, show off um, a few cards that I got. Shout out to uh, Ben Martinez, one of our fellow uh, Autographers Anonymous podcast hosts. He went to a um, AAA game where the uh, Nashville Sounds were playing Las Vegas. I forgot what the Las Vegas team's name is. But Nashville Sounds is the Rangers AAA team, and he got some stuff signed for me so I got uh, Howard Johnson on a 91 Fleer one for me one for Megan for her set we got a uh, we got a Gino Petrali and then that's three for my Rangers PCs and then I got uh, Jason Wood for my Rough Riders team set Brady Feigl and Wes Benjamin so again Ben thanks a lot for that let's get on to the TTMs okay the first one here coming back one of one in 17 days Mr. Charlie Puello I'm guessing that's how you pronounce it here on a 2000 not 2000 here on a 1989 tops Uh, Charlie here pitched for eight years in the majors, uh, starting in 1981 with the New York Mets, then went on to Cincinnati and ended his career in 1989 with the Atlanta Braves. He was 29 and 39 for a win loss record in 180 games. He had 387 strikeouts and ended his career with a 4.25 ERA. All right, next one here coming back. Four of four in 26 days, Mr. Bob Tewksbury. So here we have a 1990 Tops traded, a 1991 Tops, a 1992 Tops, and then from my uh, Rangers PC, a 1996 Tops. Mr. Tewksbury here played for 13 years in the majors, starting in 1986 with the New York Yankees, then played uh, for Chicago Cubs, St. Louis Cardinals, Texas Rangers, San Diego Padres, and ended his career in 1998 with the Minnesota Twins. He had 110 wins, 102 losses in 302 games. He had 800, uh, 812 strikeouts in a Lifetime ERA of 392. Uh, Mr. Tewksbury here was an all star in 1992. All right, next one here coming back 4 of 4 in 22 days. Mr. Garth Org here in a 1982 uh, tops, a 1984 tops, a 19. 86 tops and 1988 tops. Org played for nine years in the majors, all with Toronto, um, from 1978 to 1987. He had um, 633 hits, 20 home runs, 238 RBIs, and a lifetime batting average of 258. Uh, next one here. Coming back 4 of 4 in 53 days, Mr. Frank DePino, De here on a 1982 Topps rookie card. 
1990 score. And then for the set, 1991 Fleer. And one for Megan. Uh, DePino pitched for 12 years in the major, starting in 1981 with Milwaukee. Then went on to pitch for Houston, Chicago Cubs, St. Louis, and finished in 1993 with Kansas City. He was 35 and 38 in 514 games. He had 515 strikeouts and had a lifetime ERA of 3.83 or 3.83. All right. Next one here is one I just recently had one of my Q and A's on. Coming back four of four in seven days, Mr. Claude Osteen here on a 1974 tops. 1976 tops, 1964 tops, and then I'm not sure on this one. This one of the uh, little uh, game pieces. All right, Mr. Osteen here pitched for 18 years in the majors, starting in 1957 with Cincinnati Reds, and then he went on to play for, or pitch for Washington Senators, LA Dodgers. Houston Astros, St. Louis Cardinals, and finished up in 1975 with the Chicago White Sox. He had 196 wins, 195 losses, and 541 games. He had 1,612 strikeouts and a lifetime ERA of 3.30. He was a three-time All-Star and won the 1965 World Series. All right, now that's all of the... Uh, cards and baseball and then we're going to do the, my last one here is going to be uh, another entertainment I'm trying to get more entertainment coming in it's just uh, I mainly collect the 8 by 10s so it, it's a little more costly um, all right so coming back one of one in 29 days mr. Usman Ali now here is a picture that he was in and one of my favorite series a series of unfortunate events. He's been in several other things, um, suits and um, Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. and a few others, but uh, definitely a, somebody to watch out for. Alright, that's all I have today. Um, I'm, I already checked informed delivery, nothing's coming in for today, so this week ends. I'm hoping next week I can get back on a regular, regular update That's when I get stuff in. As always, like, comment, subscribe, and thanks for watching.